Hi, Sarah. Well, these new laws range from erasing thousands of criminal records to an increase in lawmakers' salaries. Some of these laws controversial, others passed with bipartisan support. And state legislators tell me while they're celebrating the passage of a few, they'll be closely monitoring and even looking to repeal others. Many of us are going to be watching to see how these things play out. These things, new state laws slated for a January 1st start date. While legislators say some are hits, they think others might be misses. So it's not going to be paid by the motor carriers. It's not going to be paid by the truck drivers. State Representative Tom Delnicki is talking about the highway use fee, also called the truck tax, which will be imposed on certain heavy carriers up to 17 and a half cents per mile. The measure is expected to generate about $90 million per year for transportation improvements in the state and Democrats like State Representative Matt Blumenthal say this revenue is needed. All the states around us are already drawing from these trucks. Connecticut is just allowing them to get through with uh, essentially uh, less fee at this point. But opponents argue it's a hidden cost for residents and say they're considering introducing bills in the upcoming legislative session to repeal it. That's something we really need to keep an eye on. I would wholeheartedly support repealing that tax. Another disagreement, criminal record erasure. Two new laws will allow residents with cannabis possession and certain low-level offenses to have their records cleared. People who have not reoffended for a long time face tremendous challenges as a result of having these convictions on their records. It almost seems like we're giving more rights to some of the folks that were doing bad deals. Lawmakers agree overall these measures are just a down payment for more work to be done in the next legislative session. It's a reminder of what we have accomplished, what we can accomplish, and what we have to accomplish in the future to make life better for the residents of Connecticut. You can find more information and a full list of all the new laws taking effect January 1st on our website at fox61.com. Sarah.